Western Digital creates bleeding edge hard drives for your newest computers. So you saw that intro, and this is what we're going to be going about. And this is a Western Digital Black 250 gigabytes against an SSD against a multimedia card. Now, which which you put? Which should you put in your computer? Now, I want to say this is great if you just have mass amounts of data that you want to store. And a tip, never touch those gold things. Now, our second contester is a micromedia card. So, so this is a, the smallest type that we're going to have in a computer. It's possible to have it. And then we have an SSD, but unfortunately, I do not have an SSD with me right now. I may be getting one for future references, but an SSD, it, it's, for now, it's the most powerful card out there, well, um, memory unit out there, but normally, this is going well, the 6 terabyte hard drive with a 1 terabyte SSD. Now, if you have an SSD right now and you're watching this video, but I have zero views, but I'm going to get there, I'm going to keep working at it. But, um, the best setup right now would be, I'd say, a 4 terabyte hard drive. I know I just said 6, but 4 terabytes is a little more reasonable with a 1 terabyte SSD. Now, if you really want to be high tech and you want to spend a little more m money, but you want to be completely awesome if you're going for a mini ITX build, you want to go with an MMC card. They make 128 gigabyte versions. This is just a 128 melib megabyte. Oh my god. Megabyte. And I believe it's the same thing as what would go in a camera. So those will be the best. I think SanDisk creates, well, has uh, 200 gigabyte versions. So I think if you're going to want to go full out just get maybe eight sand discs and you will be the coolest person so guys please like comment and subscribe and have a good